What is going on guys, it's Mikey Virus here, and in today's video we are playing Graveyard, so yay, Graveyard. Um, honestly, this game, I was debating even recording a video today because every deck I play against is Lava Hound. I mean, like, I went through the Classic Challenge a few times and it was all Lava Hound, which I, I don't know, I struggle to beat with any deck. Um, I don't know, I just struggle against Lava Hound, um, in general, no matter what deck I'm playing, really, um, and, yeah, I just, uh, played it a ton, and I'm lucky it's not Lava Hound here, but, I mean, there's just so much Lava Hound right now, it's kind of like, it feels like you really need, like, a strong air deck to even, like, play on ladder or anything right now, um, maybe other people are having different experiences, I don't know, but... I just played so much of it. I was debating just not recording. Um, and then the games that weren't Lava Hound, the people usually ended up just leaving. And I don't want to, like... I don't want to record or, like, put in a video just somebody leaving. I think that's a little... I don't know. I think that's a little silly and kind of, you know, defeats the purpose of recording in general. So I was really struggling to even get games to show. But, I mean, this one should be fine and we'll, we'll see how it goes i mean if this is a day late or whatever it's because i was running into only lava hound but i don't know um i'll probably record this one or upload this one when i lose because it's a not lava hound and then we'll see if i have the mental power to play two more for the video i mean i only record three games for videos which isn't bad i know like some people record like five or ten but Ugh, my mental health is struggling playing against all this lava hound. Or, I don't know, Beatdown it seems pretty popular right now. I even played against Golem, like, twice. So we... I'll take the poison on the mirrored goblin hunt. Um, I don't know, it's gonna be really hard to, like, go graveyard with all that stuff just swarming, so... I don't really know. That's a pretty big push. I'm not sure if we'll stop it. Go Natal Barb Barrel. It does still connect. Um, we only have four elixir to stop these E-Barbs, so hopefully Valkyrie clears it up. And we're actually pretty lucky that the Ice Wizard actually turned instead of walking away. So, kind of clutch. Still in the game, I guess. Seems like Poison Cycle is going to be my main source of offense, because, you know, Spawner deck, Mirror Spawner, is kind of going to be rough to deal with. It would be a lot more difficult to deal with. Well, I guess not. I don't know if putting him on the same side would be the player or not. Because obviously I do have a lot of splash, so maybe not. I don't know. I'm just going to try Graveyard here and see if we can break through at all. Um, let's just get a poison, but we need to defend this a little bit, so... Oh, well. <laughs> we took tower. I don't know how that happened, but yeah. Just really happy it wasn't Graveyard. Graveyard? No, Graveyard's fine. I was really happy it wasn't Lava Hound, so... Anyways, we BM spawner, spawners, we'll BM Lava Hound, we'll BM Beatdown. We'll BM everything, because we're toxic. I don't know, toxic mood again today, so yeah, I'll just go ahead and see you in the second match. I don't know what it is about this game that just makes me toxic. I swear I'm not always like this, but it's just like, I hate every deck in the game. Like, I complain about everything. I don't like Lava Hound, I don't like Golem, I don't like... Well, pretty much just Lava Hound and Golem, to be honest. I don't even mind, like, E-Giant or E-Golem. Maybe E-Golem more than E-Giant, but either way, I think... I don't mind them as much. I just think... The... I don't know, I think... I don't even know what it is about Golem and Lava Hound. Like, it's not like they're super easy or anything. But there's something that just really makes me angry, and I don't know what it is. Anyway, we have Pekka Witch, so no clue what this is. I'm not sure how that didn't splash, and then it takes one skeleton. Ice Wizard, kind of butt, but oh well. Um, could probably Graveyard with this. See what he has. Expect like Skarmy. Oh. <laughs> I didn't expect Barbs, but uh, Skarmy, I don't know, just felt right on the deck. So it um, looks like a lot of spam. Is this a deck, actually? Like, an actual usable deck? Please, Larry. Wow. He cocked back his arm and then just got shot. That's sad. I feel like this is like an actual deck, but I don't... Okay, it's definitely not an actual deck, now that I see 
Elixir Golem. I just talked about how I don't hate Eagle on the Especially with Graveyard, like, how would you ever hate Eagle on with Graveyard? Like, it's just so easy. It's so easy to clean up. I mean, yeah, I got some damage, but, like, now we have a ton of Elixir, and we can start pushing both lanes. Um, obviously, I, I could have went for, like, the three tower, but I didn't know if that was worth it or not. It probably was, given that Skarmie's gonna stop this entire push. And Barb's, wow, you really overspent. Might be able to get a three crown here. It might be easier, to be honest. I don't know. We'll baby dragon for this. Um, Pekka. Um, could probably just tombstone. We'll see what he puts behind it. <laughs> okay, he <laughs> went elixir golem. Um, that's gonna make this push really easy because the skeletons are just gonna clean up. Um, I'll still defend it. I want the baby dragon to push on that side, which is why I placed it over there. I don't know. Pretty. Pretty classic stuff. I believe my baby dragon should target that, and it does cross, luckily. If it didn't cross, we probably would have to play something else. Also, kind of lucky it's not splashing the tombstone. I don't know, a lot of stuff happening there. Uh, I don't know. So, I was talking about how I kept running into... Um... Lava Hound, but I wasn't playing this deck. Um, I switched to this because I tilted pretty hard. I was trying Minor Control, but, like, not Minor Control with Inferno Tower, which I think would have been easier. I was trying it with Tesla, but uh, it's just not fun. I was... It, it was all beat down, and I can't defend beat down. Anyway, um... Yeah, nice game there. We'll get into the last one. Alright, final game here against Ethan. We're still pretty low. We're at like 6,300. I don't know what that said. I didn't look before either. He's at 6,300, so we had to be close. We might be below. I don't know. I need to push, but I don't have any motivation. Maybe a stream at some point. That's the only thing I could think that would actually make me want to play. Anyway, we'll take the poison here. Um, I think it actually would have walked out of the poison if it wasn't for that skelly, so kind of clutch. Kind of clutch Larry. Um... Already looking like a hog deck, and it just repl they just it. I always say it. I don't know why. Um, and they just replaced. Um, well, I guess it might not be. I was thinking they just replaced Knight with her. Okay, it is a hog deck. Uh, I was thinking they just it was two point six, and they just replaced. Oh, what the hell's it? What's it called? I don't know. What was it called? Ice Golem with um, Knight is what I've been trying to say for the last half an hour. Um, but it looks like they replaced a lot of stuff. They replaced Ice Spirit with E-Spirit and Cannon with Bomb Tower. So pretty interesting. Other than that, I, th I assume it's the same with Fireball and... I guess with Fireball? Is that the only card we haven't seen? No, we haven't seen like Skellies or anything either. We'll see if they're running skellies or not. They could be running goblins. I've seen that change happen a lot, specifically in minor control. I don't know, that's a decent poison, but I'm not feeling it. There's a way underleveled bomb tower, but it's not really going to matter too much in this matchup. I assume it's still one shot skellies. If not, then it does matter. Um, see what they have. It is goblins, so. Yeah, that change has been happening a lot. I wish the um, musketeer was in that poison. Oh, really good damage there. Yeah, I think he's actually going to kind of struggle to deal with... Um, it's a pretty big push. I think I just NATO the hog. And we missed the... <laughs> we missed the Musketeer, so that's pretty unfortunate. Well, Valk here should clean up everything. She takes more damage than I would have liked. Poison this. The Valk should keep it in long enough to die from the poison. Um... There's another hog. We can barb barrel it and NATO again. Eventually I'm gonna have to stop NATOing at King Tower, but like at what point do I stop doing that? Maybe Maybe soon. I feel like we can defend it with like Ice Wiz Valk. Once again taking the poison, I'm really surprised he keeps cycling stuff behind his tower, or like in poison range. Really odd. Uh, one hit's not bad. I'll take it. We can Graveyard with this. We don't have Poison in Cycle, so Goblins are looking pretty good here. I'm gonna NATO, though, just kind of pull everything up to the Baby Dragon and Valkyrie. Um, decent damage, kinda-ish. Um, Barbarrel obviously needs to finish off that Knight and hopefully hit the Musk. I keep missing it. 
How do I keep doing that? The Valk actually was blocking the hog for long enough to where the tombstone pretty much fully defended it, which is kind of funny, kind of lucky. Um, take the poison again. I don't know why he keeps giving me poison value. You'd think he would be avoiding that really hard. What do I know? I mean, obviously hogs gonna come down. Try to defend it with Ice Wiz Tombstone. I think that might be enough. We'll go ahead and Bar Barrel as well. He's fireballing. I'm not really worried about him spell cycling. We can always outdo it. I mean, because we're so far ahead in damage, at least. Um, have we seen the log? I just thought about that. Maybe he doesn't have log. Maybe he's just not using it. I don't know. I mean, I can just start poison cycling, really. So I'm just going to throw one down no matter what. But, I mean, we only need, like, a few hits. We got two. I think we got only two hits there. I'm not sure how much a poison actually does. Get a NATO this to King again. I actually thought I messed it up. I did get a hit, too, so it was kind of messed up. Anyways, we can Graveyard Poison with this. I'm not too worried about the Bomb Tower. I'm really just doing it to, so he has to defend and, you know, we get Poison Cycle off. Now, uh, Tombstone again. Um, Ice Wiz over here. We could have put it directly on, I guess. Um, yeah, missed the Fireball. We just need to cycle back to Poison. And, yeah, that is GG. I don't know, man. My, the commentary probably sucked. I don't know. Um... Yeah, I, I don't know. I was just <laughs> I was just not feeling all those lava hounds I played against. Anyways, I will see you guys later. Peace.